feels a little bit weird shooting outside, kind of being a bit quiet just in case the neighbours hear, because that'll be a bit embarrassing. And my dad's about to walk out, which will be equally embarrassing. But um, yeah, I'm just about to shoot my um, charity shop video, showing you like tips and tricks and stuff. So I hope you enjoy. Like people pass walking by, and I've never filmed in like public, so I'm making a huge sacrifice for you. We're just outside the um, Renaissance charity shop, and I'm just about to show you some tips and tricks on how to really like work a charity shop and know where to go. So yes, follow me. <laughs> God, I'm really worried because we don't have the manager's promotion or anything. Um, like I'd always opt for like really small ones. This is really cute. But um, like I'd probably chop that off and like put a chain around it or something. Just like look for like one-off pieces. Um, you're fine. You know, like so. Um, <coughs> scarves you kind of want to look for. I do it for like head scarves type of thing. Um, but there's nothing here today. Oh, and like belts yeah. are always good for charity shops. Like stuff like this you don't want, but like stuff that looks like it's aged a bit. Gold, like this is alright. If I wanted it, if I didn't already have like belts, I'd go for that, I guess. Um, yeah, <laughs> like another tip is to look rack by rack, like don't just look at the front, you have to literally go through piece by piece. Um, really <laughs> um, as I said before, if you find like, I really like this, so I could belt it and turn it into a big tube dress like I said before. But how much is it? This is for a quid though, which I know sounds stupid, but it's a little bit out of my price range. I'm usually up for like two pounds, two pound fifty in charity shops, just because you know that you can afford to. Um, also, a big thing to look at is this is going to be a little bit hard. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Like men's shirts and stuff because um yeah if you find like a really nice pattern like that's quite cool or I can't find anything else really but yeah just like check patterns or like what's really in right now is like um light blue and white stripes so if you find just anything in the men's shirt aisle I'll, I'll show you like when I get home how to like fix it once I find one but um yeah that's about it I'm getting a bit nervous now. I found this in like the jewelry section, which is a bit too close to the counter for my comfort, to be honest. But yeah, it's really pretty, and it's only 50p, so I think I'm gonna get it. It's cool. Found another dress. Oh god! <laughs> Anyways, yeah, it's got it's from New York, and it's got these ruffle detailings, and it's made out below. I quite like it, so I might try it on. This is what it looks like on. I really like the actual material because it's made out of like filler. Or velvet. I don't like the ruffles. I would like it if it was like this, like asymmetric. Because there's two, it just looks kind of ordinary. Like I'm going to funeral or something. I don't really like it. So I might buy it just to alter it and show you how I can like change it up. Um, another tip is don't buy anything from Primark in a charity shop just because like you could get it pretty much the same price anyway. Okay, so this is Primark. Um, these from Primark, they're a quid in Primark. They're here, they're £2.50, so I'm just going to avoid that like, straight off. Another thing to look for is like um, the bargain buckets. Like that's really nice, that caught my eye straight away. It's quite pretty. <laughs> We're in Costa, just going to go off I've got a few items that I'll show you back home. But um, yeah, this is the now. Enjoy the video.